I recently published a video on my YouTube channel on how to run your Selenium test with extensions. And recently, again, I got one more comment. Okay, can we disable the ads? Can we block the ads which is coming on an application while practicing? I can understand your situation because the moment you start learning Selenium, you will be referring multiple web applications and many web applications having ads enabled, right? Sometimes because of these ads, you might get multiple issues or sometimes you will be getting a lot of exceptions. So if you want to disable these ads while practicing or while running your Selenium test, you can easily do that. How you can do that? So in order to understand this example, you have to watch my previous video, which I have recorded two days back. So I will give you the link in the description or you will find on my YouTube channel. So in that example, we discussed how to run your test with extension. And this is the code which I have written. In the last example, I showed you selectors of with test case studio. And now I will show you with ad blocker. So basically in order to block the ads, I use one of the extension called ad block. So again, it's a free extension. The moment you download this extension, you can block the ads. So in order to get the this extension, I will search for ad block and you will get this extension ad block. Now in order to get the CRX file, I will right click on this and get this option, which is get CRX of this extension. The moment I click on it, it will ask me to download. I will just rename this as ad block. Okay. And now this is available here. Now give me one minute. Let me copy the CRX file from my local system to the extension folder. So I have downloaded the extension and I have kept in my extensions folder. Now let me show you how you can do that. In case if you missed the previous video, also no issue. I will show you again from the scratch. But if you want in depth explanation, I would highly recommend you to watch that video. Hardly it will take 10 minutes, but you will get a lot of insight about the different methods constructors. So let me create one class called stop ads. And I'm using main method, but you can use test and JJ unit at the rate test annotation. Now, in order to work with this extension, I will be creating object of Chrome options class. So in previous videos, we discussed how to use Chrome options for running the test in incognito mode, setting up the binary, uh, running the test in the headless mode, various examples we have seen. So I'm creating object of uh, Chrome options, which is a dedicated class. And now I will be using this method called dot add extensions. I can give multiple files here, but in this example, we are taking only one file and this file is nothing but our extension. So I'm going to create object of a file class using a new keyword. And in the path, I will provide the path of this extension. So extension is available inside extensions folder. So I will put dot so that it should take current working directory. Then I will take extensions, which is the folder name. And now I can provide the name of this extension slash add block dot CRX file. That's all. Now, when you start your session, web driver driver equal to new Chrome driver, you can pass this extension. So Chrome driver OPT. Now with this driver, whatever web application you will launch, it will block the ads. So let me use any of the application. You can take any application where you're getting the ads. Officially, I can't take the name of the applications. So I will stick to any application. The main objective is to show you that the session will start with the ad blocker. So the moment you run this, you will see the ads. So yes, on Google uh, homepage, we don't have any ads. So, but if you see here, ad blocker is already available when you're running your test. And it says ad block is now installed. It's a very small video, but very interesting one. How to remove the ads while running your Selenium test. So in case if you find this video interesting, please share with your friends and I will see you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care.